Brotherhood, what does that mean to you? Normally we'll hear in like fraternities, we'll hear it between each other and stuff. But for me, coming from a military background, it's what kept us, you know, that much closer and everything else. It was something that I could count on the person to left or right to me. Not worry about any kind of, you know, natural instincts, knowing that they had my back no matter what. If it was on the battlefield or even just, you know, back in the rear, pretty much just taking care of, you know, natural business. And so something I like to bring over here was just a positive mental attitude of, you know, hey, waking up, pretty much um, just keeping a bright outlook no matter what the situation is. I am trying to major in cognitive therapy and I'm going to pretty much go under the influence of Carol Dweck. She has the growth and fixed mindset. It's understanding how individuals see their vulnerabilities versus how they could actually see their growth and progression on success. And with that, I want to bring that to the veterans, the Wounded Warrior Project, and then I also want to bring it to other individuals that need it for, say, for TBI, um, PTSD, and so many other aspects that it can go to. One positive attribute that I've been known to have is determination. No matter what it is that I've signed myself up to, I plan to get it finished. Even if it's, you know, me going on the gas pedal 100 miles per hour, going down, you know, down trail the whole entire way till I crash, I plan to at least finish it. And so, with that, I want to say I enjoy coming to this class. I enjoy meeting you all, hearing your voices, hearing, your, you know, your stories and everything else. Random fact about me, I love food. So, I love to travel and I love to try new food. So, if you have any new food, new, you know, areas you want to check out, let me know, because I'm always interested. I'm always, you know, down to try something new. And then for the random quote, the richest people in the world look to make and build relationships. Other people just look for work. And all that means is, you know, communicate with those other individuals around you. Look to actually, you know, build an influence. Try to, if you can, just connect with individuals in a different area code because you have that much of more influence versus those individuals that you're looking for the local community. My name is Seth J. Garza. That's all I have for you gents.